And away we go on a chilly Monday afternoon here in the Midwest. And the first pitch taken for a ball inside. Edward Olivares on a three-game hitting streak. He's four for his last seven and fouls that back. An off-speed, which would probably be the changeup most of the time. Just needs a pitch hitting ahead. And so use all of his pitches and throw strikes. Missed in, and it's two and two. Chicago, so he is done for the season. That is a big, big loss for Kansas City, and that's tap foul. So Olivera nine different times. Nine. That would be the uh, Omaha shuttle. I would say so. <laughs> nine times, man. That's that's a lot. But it's you know what? Fouled back. At least it's him that's going up and down and just veering off left and heading home once in a while. Yeah. He's battling right now. The pitch at 95 from Matt. But when you try to pick it up a notch, you might lose a little bit of control. There's a changeup pulled foul on the 3 2. I think at the beginning. Then acquired by Kansas City in 2020. 3 2 pitch. Fouled back by Olivares. 100%. 3 2 pitch. Look at his hands right there, too. It almost has like a little tiny split grip. Top hand, the way it looks, is trying to prevent that or trying to stop that from happening. And Mats wins the battle and a strikeout to start this afternoon. Whit Merrifield has proven himself to be one tough out. Huh. This guy can play. Big time. Steals bases among the. That extends the Royals franchise record. And that is the Major League Baseball mo of Cal. It's only 2,142 <laughs> away. I think I did the numbers last year. He would have games. The pitch taken just a bit high, and it's two and two. I was there for the three games. Pretty awesome. So you saw him go around the the warning uh, track. He and ran right past me. Wave in history. Yeah, it was cool. Three two pitch. And every time you see it, the same thing sticks out in my mind every time. Villard says right below it, it'll say Villardi. Two run double for New York. Three two pitch popped up into shallow right. Carlson calling out Brendan Donovan and he makes the catch very very special it was amazing to be there that night the pitch taken in by Benintendi off to a good start out of the way of uh, Carlson coming in that's a key I think for an outfielder when they call off the infield and uh, that's a big deal every time you see problems with the outfielder and the infielder usually is because the infield he's going to get to more balls with Tommy Edmond not at second base more than likely and there's a base hit to left Full swing. so two out hit Andrew Benatendi and it brings in Salvador Perez you can't draw it up any better somebody's going to be on TV every single night and you got one that will go down as one of the greatest at nearly 50 home runs a year ago and he hits it high in the air, right center, and Bader under it. Harrison Bader will lead it off. Now, Bader homered from the number two spot yesterday. He joked in his post-game interview. He said, "It's about time we." Early <laughs> has been Paul Goldschmidt. Only took a little offense to that and said, "I'll show you." <laughs> in the lineup, but Ollie saying that he does feel much better today, and he could have played. But this was a scheduled off day anyway. He said one of the things that we have to do. On that body than the normal guy that's standing at first or third or right or left. So three middle positions are tough. And then catcher obviously. Been better to start this year than they were last year in which he won the gold glove. Cardinals with some roster moves here today as well. Packy Naughton sent to AAA Memphis. And very much to the point, he said, performance. <laughs> and a ground ball that's hit to short. And Jimmy, the thing I liked about it is then he went. You know, we talked about a lot of guys getting stuck in, in the minor leagues behind, say, a Yachty Molina or a Albert Pujols or a Goldschmidt or whatever. Play, let's use him. Let's give him an opportunity to help his family survive in the world. Let's move on, give him away, and get to the number one prospect in baseball is Bobby Wood Jr. Off to a slow start. 
count of one. He's going to be the face of the franchise. He's the next George Brett. All those things. Glove by DeYoung. Tough play, and he beat it out. Run, too. So now it's like Goldie when Witt gets to first base. Maybe you have a little conversation like, how's it going? Mats to Taylor. Four for 26. A little bit of a bullpen game yesterday. So you want to stay in the game as long as you can. One and two. First question was to him, how are you going to get him? <laughs> Let me hear your mindset. There's a strikeout on the inside corner. Stayed with him. Series tomorrow night at Kauffman Stadium. Be a good and little first crowd. First pitch taken low. Be a good little crowd for the ball. It's actually better than I thought it might be. Here's the 1 0 pitch. Two balls and no strikes since the start of 2021, and that's fifth most in the American League. Yeah, you can just see right there in that one swing. That tells you everything. Usually early on, you're trying to swing big, but if you stay inside the ball, then that's your idea. So, yeah, slide on over. Number of the Cardinals for Steven Matz and the 2 2. Put in play. Brendan Donovan to his right. And the first out here in the fist. And then after that outing, he's going to start that game. They'll see what the next step is in his comeback. And that is off the wall, taken there by Carlson. And the leadoff man, Olivares, with a one out stand. So if they're saying that nothing changed with the baseballs. As Merrifield hits it out to right field. Carlson with the catch. Well, Lavar is not going anywhere, and that's uh, number move. two. So they've only had 145 at bats in this position a month plus into the season. That's fourth from the bottom in baseball, so they're trying to generate some. That's why they always say when the weather gets warm, certain players heat up. Yep. Dave Parker once said, when the leaves turn brown. Remember when he was here? You had the hitman, Mike Eastler. That's oh. sharply hit. Goldie to Mats. Here's Salvador Perez fly to center. And the first pitch off the plate for a ball. He's 0 for hit since he left here. Yep, one <laughs> swing. This guy could swing it. Woof, what a cut. One and one. Trying to. But that Albert. Yachty and Wayno. All together inside that Cardinal dugout. Guys, each other day, I got on the bus. I think it was in Cincinnati. The day you didn't get on the bus happened like it was like 2006 all over again. Perez hits it to deep left. And there is O'Neill uh, at the edge of the track to make the catch. Smiling his entire career. But the other two, you know, they're having a little more fun. Bring up anything that's not kind of out there. But, you know, I talked to Yadi a bunch and he, he said to me one time, which just was a better place for, you know, a couple of those guys, Adam just being Adam. I mean, ripped out to left center, Bader diving for it, past him and all the way to the wall. Backing it up, O'Neill and Santana in at second base and the great effort there by Bader. I thought he was going to catch that ball. First guy up on the step yesterday when Albert did something well and then Yachty and then who's you know, they bring so much to the table other than just playing on the field each day, and they're just so much. Do you remember when we saw him in, uh, I think it was Milwaukee? Strike out of Matt, for Mats, and that's number three. A couple swings maybe in Milwaukee, or maybe it was... Sent and when Grinke was scheduled to pitch against the Cardinals earlier this season, Ali had said, don't be surprised to see, to get that start here or there, there'll be some lefties coming up this week that he wants to get him in. He said, now, if he was the DH. Oh, go back to what, looking at those three guys. Albert looks like he's in amazing shape. Look at him. The 2-1 pitch. And it's now a count of two. That's his set, and here comes a 2-2. We have a lefty going for Kansas City of Houston. Along with him. As Witt hits it out of play. And the 2-2 popped him up on the infield. Goldie wants it and has it. Royals have left four on.
for an arm. And Danny, as you know, the key for Ryan, he's healthy, especially that knee. Yeah, we for him as a right-hander, and he was telling us about how he's able to get on top of the ball, we're compensated for the pain in the knee, and sometimes mechanics can get a little bit out of whack. But he's not just, but the cutter, slider, whatever you want to call it, has become such a weapon for him as well. Cut off by Arenado, and quickly to first and makes the play. And there's conviction with every pitch. Grounded out to second. A lot of strikes today from Mats. Right around 70% strikes. And Grinky. And the 0-1 to Lopez. Does he get that call? It's the beginning of last year. Eighth best in the American League. Nasty pitch right there. One and two. The one two. Went back to it and he struck him out. Great pitch, great idea, great pitch. Top of the lineup, Olivares. Hits it to short. And he's one for three today. Matches through five, a nine pitch. About as good as you can get. I mean, that's just an unbelievable play. Everything had to be perfect right there. Padding there. Yeah. Yes. That's just great. Had a big old smile on his face. I was going to say he's going to be smiling for days with that play. And a 1 1 pitch to Merrifield. And he lines it to left, sinking, and a diving catch. Tyler O'Neill on a ball that was sinking. Now Andrew Benatendi. And he's hit by the pitch. The slider, I think, huh? The ball was in the air where he could time anything. He got a little bit of a time because as an as an outfielder, you're timing it. And so if that doesn't work out, you don't get there. Oh, and two on Perez. And that ball was hit. And the 0 2 pitch. Perez spoils it. I'd like to go back and see. And that is off the plate. And the 1 2 pitch. Runner goes. And now picked down to first. Ben Attendee started towards second and stopped. Got back to the bag. He gave. Kisner the advantage there. It's fouled back. But that's what base running is all about, right? Putting yourself in a good position. It's not just running out. You can stop and get back. 2-2. Two -two. And Perez gets underneath it. Donovan going out. Bader coming in. It's Brendan Donovan, the second baseman, to make the catch. BJC Healthcare difference maker Steven Matz. What have you seen, Jimmy? Not only is that fastball jumping out of his hands today, he's really thinking through some of these at bats and he's hitting his location. So he seems to get settled in Pitch. in the month of May. Now it's nothing. And the 0 2 pitch inside. That's baseball. The one two. Two and two. Here is being able to throw strikes inside, pitch inside. Line to center. And Bader is there. Midway. <laughs>